here we are. We're back for another Mohawk Minute movie. Here are your kiddos. All right, we have London and Larissa, our twins from Kindergarten Girls. Tell us what the kindergartners have been learning about this week. Um, What's the letter of the week? N and M. N and M. One of you has two N's in your name. Who is it? London does. Okay. What have you been doing in math? Eye colors, but what did you do with the eye colors after you colored in the eye for yours, for the blue for your eyes? What did you do with it? Um, we colored, we colored, we colored the color for our eyes. And then you put it on a great big what? Um, a great big paper. To make a graph. Very good. There was the word, the graph. Did you make graphs for other things too? Yeah. Like what? Like, um, like. We have been cutting and gluing. Lots of cutting and gluing this week, huh? It's a mess. It makes it a mess? Yeah. yeah. I've got them in little tiny pieces. Yeah. Did you make one for your hair color, too? Yeah. What about for your favorite animal? Yeah. What was your favorite animal? I like monkeys. Monkeys? What about you, Larissa? Um, a giraffe. Giraffes. Okay. Do you want to wave to your classmates? Your friends in your class? Yeah. Um, Cassie. Okay. Okay, what about to mom? You want to wave at mom too? Yeah. Okay, wave. Good job, girls. All right, Trenton, tell us what the first graders have been doing this week. We're working on blends on the end, like fast. What's the blend on the end of the word fast? S-T. Good. What else have you been doing? I can, like, people can speak loud enough so that everyone can hear. Okay. And I can... And I can solve story problems. Ooh, that's hard, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. And nonfiction life at the a pond. Hey, did you read your leveled reader this week? Yes. What was that one about? It was about stuff at the pond and ha what lives at the pond. Yeah, lots of animal stories this week. And habitats. Oh, yeah, that's a fancy word. Do you know what that means? It means, um, like, places for stuff. Yeah, where they live, doesn't it? Yes. Okay. You got anything else? No. Nope. Okay, show us what's behind you. Stand up there and point to where your picture is. Okay, and Trenton, what are these? There's a whole bunch of them up there. They're goals. They're your goals. How do you decide what you want to write down on your post-it note for your goal? You can just figure out what you want to do. What you want to get better at, huh? Yes. Trenton, what was your weekly goal? Talk less. Talk less. I like that goal. All the first graders are doing this, aren't they? Yes. Yeah. All right. Who do you want to say hi to? Uh, my class. All right. Wave at them. Hi. All right, Landon. Tell us what the second graders have been learning this week. Um, we've been doing math place value with three and four digit numbers. Oh, yeah. I saw some of the kids were using the phase 10 blocks, like the flats and the rods and the cubes. Does that help sometimes or does it make it harder? Mm, sometimes it helps. Yeah, sometimes. Okay, what else have you been doing? Um, we've been reading about animal habitats like um, sea turtles and prairie bird dogs. Oh, cool. There have been lots of animal stories around the building this week. All the grade levels have been reading about animals. Did you know that? No. That's kind of cool, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay, what else you got? Suffixes, your main topics. Mm, suffixes. What are those? Do you remember? Things that go on the beginning or ends of words. Good. Very nice. They're parts that go at the beginning, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Okay. What else you got? Beginning and ending. Um, what else you got? We have... Did you say beginning and ending? They go... Which part do they go at? Um, they go... It's not the beginning. The end. There you go. The suffixes go at the end. Do you know what it's called when they come at the beginning? Um, no. Prefix. Pre is at the beginning and suffix is at the end. Okay. All right. Anything else you want to share with us? Um, we have been learning about bats. Oh, 
Yeah, I heard you read a pretty awesome book about bats. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, Landon, who do you want to say hi to? Um, my family, my friends, and my brother. All right, wave at him. Good job, bud. All right, Kaylee, tell us what the third graders have been learning this week. We've been starting multiplication. Ooh, is that hard? Not really. Once you kind of get the hang of it, it's pretty easy. Okay. We've been making arrays and learning how um, addition and multiplication are actually pretty alike. Oh, they're connected, aren't they? Like sisters. Yeah. Okay. What else do you have? Um, well, today we're going to, if it's not, today we're going to have an AR party for the people who made their um, goals for the first nine years for the first nine weeks. I we're can't going, wait for that. If it's not raining, we're going to um, play kickball and have freezer pops. Yeah. If it is raining, we're going to do something else. I'm one of the people who, I'm one of the people who gets to do it. Oh, it's so exciting. This is your first AR party because because third graders start those AR parties in third grade, don't we? And then we're going to start Book It. Oh yeah, to earn pizza. Yeah. Pizza Hut I pizza. I really want pizza. It'll be so good. I remember doing Book It when I was a kid. Can you believe that? Last time, the last time I did it was in first grade. Okay. Okay, do you have anything else? No. Not no? You want, who do you want to say hi to? Nobody, really. Well, will you wave for me? Yeah. Okay, great job. All right, Lily, tell us what the fourth graders have been doing this week. Uh, we have been learning and we have been learning in math variables. Ooh, that's a hard word to say too, isn't it? Yeah. And uh, expression and expression and we've been learning language arts. Okay. And in that we've been, uh, yeah, language arts and we've been learning in regular plur or plural nouns. Irregular plural nouns. That's a yeah. mouthful. Are and those easy or hard? They're pretty easy. Okay, good. Um, and uh, <clears throat> like leaf, leaf and leaves. Oh, that's so a great example. So you change, you put some letters, more letters in a leaf. Yeah, you change and, that F, don't yeah. you? Good. And in science, we finished up matter unit. In lab, we found density by placing stuff in water. Oh, was that kind of cool to see? Yeah, it was really cool. Like what flow, like what floats and what doesn't. Okay. And uh, we used a scale. We used a scale balance to find mass. Oh yeah. And also we had a test today. Was it hard? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I bet. Hard. Some of those science tests are pretty tricky. Yeah. And we in reading uh, we did narrative nonfiction and true story about buffalo. I wondered, every grade level this week has had, uh, yeah. their stories have been about animals. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Anybody you want to say hi to? Uh, yeah, my class. Okay, wave at them. Hi. All right, Casey, tell us what the fifth graders have been doing this week. Well, in, in math, we've been learning about capacity units and volume of liquid. Is that easy or hard? Um, it's easy. It's a greasy. Ooh, you hear those kids back there, huh? All right, what else have you been doing? Um, we In social studies, we've been um, divided into groups of different, of different um, like continents or nations or something. Okay. And like Portugal, Africa, China. Oh, is that for their colonization, for where they went to explore and travel? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. And we have different names. And we have these flip things where, where we write the information down about about the person you are and the other people in your group. Okay, so who are you? I'm King, I'm, I'm, I'm Prince Henry. Prince Henry. Where's Prince Henry from? Um, he, well, he's, well, um, he went to Portugal. Okay. And, and that's all. Okay. I'm studying more about the, Oh, you're still learning, right? Things, right? All right, so tell us about what all this noise is behind me. Well, it's the AR party. Okay. And you get to participate because? Um, because I've, I've got the many points I need to participate in the AR party by a certain time. Yeah, you met your goal, didn't you? Mm -hmm. All right, why don't you head on back. Wave to whoever you want to. Who do you want to say hi to? Okay, Mrs. Versus class, mom and dad. Okay, go have fun, bud. We got kickball going on. 
Well, we've been very busy and we've had lots and lots of wonderful visitors this week. We want to thank you to uh, everybody who joined us for our parent-teacher conferences. We're still, still tallying up our totals and have a few more to do today after school and on Monday. So we'll let you know how those turned out, but it looks like we're getting in the 90% and that's what we like to see. We love to uh, build those relationships with our students, but also with the families because together as a team, we're going to see some great success. I want to wish a congratulations out there to kindergarten. They had the highest attendance percentage this week, 98%. Fantastic job. Also, I want to just remind everyone today coming home in a Friday folder is a pink slip that talks about our button sale next week. So the buttons are about this big and they will be, uh, you can turn them a picture. This is my daughter and we just took a picture and printed it off on normal paper and we are going to turn these into buttons for 50 cents. So if you have pictures that you would like to have made into buttons, send us the pictures. We're going to do this on Wednesday of next week. Send us the picture and, uh, or print it and send it in and we will for 50 cents turn it into a button. They just pin on onto the back very nice and easily. We'll send those home with the kids um, by the end of the week before fall break. All right. So I think that's it. We've had a fantastic week. We appreciate all your support. Have a great weekend. Mm -hmm.